Hello and welcome to this unboxing video of the 1 kW engine cooling fan reference design. My name is Martin and I will show you what is in the box. When you open up the box, first you will find a short explanation, a small block diagram and the QR code for the gated content. In the mobile view, you will get some information about the board and the products which are used and also the benefits. But of course, you can also see them on a big screen, like I have already opened on the PC. On the website, you will also get some information about the used products and also the benefits of this design. If you register the ID on Infineon.com, you will get extended content like layout files, schematics, getting started guides, hardware design guidelines, EMC measurement reports and also the thermal analysis which we have done during the design. Inside of the box you will find the reference design itself and a debug interface. The debug interface consists out of the USB cable, a link between the J-Link debug interface, the Zega debug interface itself and the reference design. The reference design is based on a six-layer PCB. It consists the system-on-chip microcontroller from the embedded power IC family and seven Optimus 6 STOL MOSFETs. Terminals on the side will give you access to the debug port. We'll have additional connectors for hall sensor interfaces, for LIN and for additional GPIOs. The design extends the power range of the embedded power family combined with Infineon MOSFETs up to 1 kW in the 12 volt operating voltage area. The design can be used for sensorless three-phase BLDC motor applications, such as engine cooling fan or high power water pumps. To get started with the reference design, you of course have to install the tool chain as described on the homepage. Opening Kyle Microvision 5, you will find the Infineon pack files for the embedded power ICs, which contains motor control examples like field oriented control and block commutation. So, for this example, we will show you the sensorless field oriented control with a single shunt measurement for our engine cooling fan setup. In our setup, I have already prepared one of the reference designs with soldered connectors. Of course, we need a power supply, which will deliver sufficient current. And we have an engine cooling fan with a power class of 350 watt. To download the code, you need to connect the debug interface. Download the code over the Kyle Microvision 5 toolchain. If you do this the first time, you will get a message to update the firmware. Click yes. Now the firmware is updated. The code is programmed and the motor will start up. Thank you for your attention. For more information, please visit our website. <music>